What is up, my brothers from another mother? This is Rob with the XRP 007 channel coming to you from beautiful island. Another beautiful day down at the beach. Five out of five. Uh, thank you so much. Uh, Saturday's video, it's closing in on 10,000 views. I'm at 8,500 so far, so we're getting close. It's going to be interesting see if I can get to 10,000 on that thing. So all you guys can help, if you would, just smash that like button. Let's see if we can get 100 likes on this video today. And if you're new to this channel, if you would, hit the sub button to, to subscribe, the bell for not notifications when I got a new video. And again, that like button tap it slap it whatever you're feeling for a taco tuesday that's sound pretty good doesn't it um tuesday so here we are this is the last week of our month of april uh, we're winding down are we going to see that beautiful summary judgment settlement come out and uh, probably summary judgment here from judge torres uh, days are ticking. We only got a few more. This day's probably gone. I have, my phone hasn't been blowing up, so I imagine we didn't get it today. So we got Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Can't you do it on Saturday or Sunday? Maybe so. I don't know. So then after that, we got a whole new set of cards. Uh, in the news, XRP is absolutely unstoppable. Ripple got approval uh, for being used as a cross, uh, being used for cross-border money by none other than the U.S. Consumer Protection Bureau. Uh, I think they're kind of giving the SEC a little of the middle finger along with Gary Gensler. This is beautiful. It's more arsenal in the fire on behalf of the Ripple case to say, look, you know, they these guys think it's definitely not a security. Is that a security? Look like a security? Smell like a security? I don't think so. But so this is huge. One more really great one. Uh, line them up, fill them up, knock them back. Um, we're going to talk about the road to $350 XRP. Uh, can it happen? And then and, and, and it begins when this happens. So I actually got two answers to that. And I was zooming out, looking again at all my different charts on my monthly, my weekly, dailies, and down to the four hours and stuff. And uh, so and the answer, and the easiest answer is that all you got to do is pull up the monthly chart of XRP. So simple. And guys, we're on the verge of that crossing over and going bullish and having a green candle on the monthly. Does it happen for this month? Doesn't look like likely unless we get that summary judgment. So I'm kind of thinking, I'm not sure. But May, I think May, regardless of a summary judgment or not, I think we're going to go and get that cross. Just look at the charts. I think it is right and prime to go. Uh, Egrag Crypto He's a little more uh, specific about this. He says, as soon as we cross over, XRP crosses over a dollar forty. It's no stopping XRP. From there, it's from dollar forty. We're on the road to three hundred and fifty. Three hundred and fifty does not happen overnight. In his humble opinion, we're talking about with his charts. It looks like it's some somewhere in the, in the area of the end of twenty four, beginning of twenty five. I will not be crying to wait that long for a $350 XRP. And what's kind of interesting is that you always, there's old saying says, show me these charts, I'll tell you the news. And so it kind of coincides, in my humble opinion, with a utility price XRP. So I'm going to talk about that um, just, and I'll come back to that. Coins Kid, uh, as of today's video, he's still looking at the 0.1618 at 81 cents for XRP to touch. And then uh, as we kind of grind sideways, he's looking at that 41 cents is where we can test support and go back down. I think we did get a bounce off of 44. I think I saw us at 47 cents. So uh, we could retrace, go all the way back down to that 41. We'll see. And the next level of support underneath that would be like 38 cents. So I'm going to have a couple of buy orders on both of those. Now, this is to follow up with um, uh, yesterday's video about uh, the pump in 2017 and 2018. And I meant to get this in, but I'm glad I have more time to actually talk about it because it's absolutely fascinating because we're talking about the length of time it took to make these moves. So uh, XRP, it, like I mentioned, it went from 0.004 to 40 cents a 100x insane and the amount of time that it took to do that 90 days about three months just round it off 90 days three months unbelievable to do a 100x uh, from here and we're talking about this at today's price that would be a 47 dollar xrp uh, that would make me happy and this gets fascinating because they're kind of conjoined together being that we make this parabolic move and then we had a, a, a roughly about six months of con consolidation and just grinding sideways before we had the other pump and so now we're up to nine months so so then the, the the that second move only took about 60 days in 2018 it took about 60 days 
and it went from let's just say roughly you know right around 40 cents up to three dollars and 84 cents you know so then we had like a, a 8x move in that case so you got a lot of ways you can kind of look at the numbers on that and then this also when you come back to you know and that will put us at that over the 300 dollar mark on that which would be so unbelievable but this comes back to a video i watched last one i watched this afternoon was uh, listening to a fellow that was in the industry uh, in blockchain and also and he was talking about the interoperability uh, when that would start actually happening and he said that we could actually see that beginning starting about 18 months from now that kind of coincides with that $300 price target so interesting uh, so here we are you know the longer they don't forget guys the longer the grind the higher the climb and the higher that final blow off top and that ain't a bad thing that'll do it for me everybody and I'll see you guys in the next video